What if you could turn on a light just by touching your USB 32? No buttons, no app or web server, just your fingertip. Welcome to the magic of capacitive touch sensing using your USB 32 DEF module. In this quick and fun project, we'll create a simple touch sensor LED system where your finger is the switch. To bring this touch sensing magic to life, you will need one USB 32 DEF board, one LED, some jumper wires, one breadboard, one micro USB cable. Let's wear it up. Take the breadboard and ESP module, insert the LED in the breadboard, connect the long leg of the LED that is anode to GPIO 18 of the USB 32, connect its short leg that is called cathode to GND. We will use this T0 touch pin which is GPIO 4 as our touch input. Because the USB 32 has a capacitive touch pins built in. So just insert one male to female jumper one in it and leave its male terminal freely. Here is a quick list of ESP32 touch capable pins. T0 that is a GPIO pin 4, T2 is GPIO 2, T3 is GPIO 15, T4 is GPIO 13, T5 is GPIO 12, T6 is GPIO 14, T7 is GPIO 27, T8 is GPIO 33, T9 is GPIO 32. In this project we are using T0 that is GPIO 4. Double check the wiring accordingly to the circuit diagram before proceeding. Now download the code file given in the description below. Open the code file if you have already downloaded the Arduino IDE. Otherwise download the Arduino IDE first. Here we are giving names to the pins we will use. Touch underscore pin is set to T0 which is GPIO 4 on the USB 32. That's our touch sensitive pin. LED underscore pin is set to GPIO 18 where we have connected the LED. We create a variable touch value to store the reading from the touch sensor. The threshold value to decide when the touch is strong enough to trigger the LED. The value you get when touching might vary based on your environment, so you can tweak this number later. Now in the setup function, we start the serial monitor at a speed of 115200 baud, so we can see the sensor values. Set the LED pin as an output, keep the LED initially turned off by writing low. Now in the loop function, we use touch read function to get the current touch sensor value and store it in touch value. Then we print this value in the serial monitor so you can observe how the value changes when you touch or release the pin. Now we are using an else condition. If the touch value is less than the threshold, that means you have touched the sensor, so we turn the LED on, otherwise the LED stays off. And we finish the loop with a 100 millisecond delay just to avoid reading too fast and give the sensor time to stabilize. Now plug your USB 32 into your computer using the USB cable. Here select board USB 32 dev module, then port and check which com port your USB is on. Now click the upload button, if it shows connected dot dot and keeps looping, press and hold boot button until it starts uploading. Once uploaded, open the serial monitor with a border rate set to 115200. Now touch GPIO 4 with your finger and watch the LED turn on like a magic. And just like that, you have created your own touch sensitive LED system using ESP32. No external touch sensor needed, just a built-in magic. We have seen that ESP32 includes multiple touch pins such as T0 through T9. This opens up a whole new world of creative possibilities. Challenge yourself, try adding different LEDs, assign each one to a different touch pin and experiment with building something even more interesting. Imagine a multi-touch interactive art installation or a custom remote control where each touch pin triggers a different response. The possibilities are endless here. If you enjoyed this project, hit like, share and subscribe for more such cool DIY tech tutorials with RoboArm.